Let's listen. Poets of the Fall, Cradled in Love. Are you all here with a friend tonight? Well, whoever you are, this song is for you, all of you. If you know the lyrics, feel free to sing along, okay? Marco, you know. Marco has such an interesting voice, right? I paused too much. We were about to get into the lighter mode. <laughs> emo, emo only chat. But um, yeah, Marco has such a unique and interesting voice. It's always so clean. It's like a rich, clean baritone. But then he can he can bring it up into head voice without losing really any of that space that allows him to create that richness in his lower tone. So in fact, he sings with a, a head voice that is also enriched through resonance that it just hits you really hard when he, when he sings in there. The lyrics, you had the blue note sapphire eyes to back up all those gazes, to pierce my guard and to take my soul off to faraway places, told me I'll never be alone because you're right there. We took a gamble with this love like sailing to the storm with the waves rushing over to take us we were battling against the tide. You were my beacon of salvation. I was your starlight. So don't cry for your love. Cry tears of joy, because you're alive, cradled in love. Don't cry for your love. Cry tears of joy, because you're alive, cradled in love. Now, what's beautiful about this is the multi-dimensions of the poetry. Now, <laughs> I'm not crying. It's just really dusty. It's just allergies. Oh, It's, you know, Poets of the Fall is the name of this band, and that's definitely not even an exaggeration because their lyrics are just as moving as their music, right? You had the, it's all about, it, it takes like a very personal story. You had the blue note sapphire eyes to back up all those gazes. It's a very personal imagery, a very specific person. And then we took a gamble with this love like sailing into the storm it becomes more be uh, more universal all right we can be him and the one person he was talking about we can be all of us in our own stories and that universal concept of taking a risk with love i th i feel like it's throughout your life that idea of the risk and the value it holds and the the value of of creating a impact through uh, creating impact in your life and, and taking risks and, and ex experiencing things that may not always turn out well that always changes throughout your life as you grow older and and things happen and things change the way you look at, at life and I'm going down a, an, an inner rabbit hole geez but the chorus is all about the audience and all about 
in or engaging with the audience and the listener. Don't cry for your love, cry tears of joy. It's clearly not that one person he was singing about in the first ver uh, first stanza. It's just a more universal message. Don't cry for your love, cry tears of joy, because you're alive, cradled in love. That's it. That's it. We, we go from a personalized thing to a more broadly interpreting perspective to a very, very clear message that reins you back into the idea of the song in general. And musically, harmonically, you're being carried along that journey in a really loving way. And this is just beautiful, beautiful music at its, at its finest. Beautiful performance. Let's continue. beautiful musical moment capriani thank you very very much for the 100 hundred dollar tip i seriously thank you so much <laughs> i'm just gonna keep bringing everything i can into this music and trying to impart whatever i can so thank you um and this this verse is is all about <laughs> the beauty of of the of the terrifying nature of of opening up to people and and creating vulnerability right i kept the love you gave me alive and now i carry it with me i know it's just a teardrop from mother earth but in it i can hear a dolphin sing telling me i'll never be alone i know you're right there right cry tears of joy right i kept the love you gave me alive and I carry it, and now I carry it with me. I know it's just a teardrop from Mother Earth. Now, we have that feeling when we experience love in romantic or other capacities, and it's a natural feeling. There's no, there's no fighting that nature. Uh, there's no, there's no, and, and so in a way, if you put yourself in the context of nature, you're just a drop in the pool. And I love the way that, they, that he describes it as a teardrop from Mother Earth. It's a gift from the world we're in and from the universe is feeling that love and it's but it's it's minute in the concept of everything but to us it can feel like everything and then the absurdity of hearing a dolphin sing <laughs> the, the absurdity the absolute absurdity hearing a dolphin sing never telling me that i'll never be alone i know you're right there what absolute madness is that you know it's 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 absolute madness <laughs> but that's what it feels like this tiny minute drop from the universe that gives you immense value and then the the feeling of togetherness that it brings you and the the meaning it brings you in your life and it, the imagery of a dolphin singing it to you it's it's that 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 intelligent beast of nature right dolphins are so much so smart right they're so they're smarter than humans and in in a way it's a it's a it's an idea you can trust right if a dog was saying it to you it'd be like okay i have two dogs i know that you'd be like you're kind of dumb but a dolphin it's much more important. It's a whimsical, far-off creature, but it still exists, you know? It's not saying a unicorn. It's saying a dolphin. And I know that focusing on that one piece of lyric is, is so odd, but it's there for a reason. I can hear a dolphin sing, telling me I'll never be alone. There's a reason it's a dolphin. A 
That's all I'm saying. There was one verse I completely forgot to talk about, um, and it was the last, the last stanza. So with the fire still burning bright, I want to gaze into your light. If I could see my fortune there, you know how flames can hypnotize. Do I even dare to speak out your name for fear it sounds like, like a lover? If you've if you've lived right, you've experienced that fear of acceptance, of the feeling of that single soul teardrop from Mother Earth, and accepting that it is that terrifyingly gigantic commitment of of being in love. I love that the the lyrics are disjointed like that, and the way he sings it is disjointed like that. find the spot. It's a stutter, right? It's a stutter. It's a it's it's a, a an engineered hesitation. Do I even dare to speak out your name for fear it sounds like? And in that silence, we all can think back to those times when we realize this person is more to us than just another person. And we all have, we have all felt that silence for the most part. And that crazy filter that's then put on everything that you've interacted that you've done with that person every thought you've had about that person in that silence between the two words of like everything changes and the way it's musically composed it's sweet and wonderful and then you just sing the chorus out and you invite the audience to sing with you. And, and Marco shares that in real human moment. And it's all in the way it's composed and the way it's performed and the way it's experienced in this context of a live event. And I, there, I couldn't imagine a better voice than Marco's like very sweet, clean, velvety, 
smooth baritone to kind of guide you through that that reminder of those moments whether it was one or a hundred different moments you've had like that where you learn to connect with someone a perfect saturday night alone at home beautiful music good company to chat with and you just poured yourself a glass of good red wine how how good can it get cheers to that my friend it's it's just beautiful. I just I want to I want to live I want to hear that moment one more time. Yeah, 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 yes. I, I'm i in awe at that lyricism there, the poetry. Like, for fear it's like, for fear it sounds like, like a lover. Cosmic, thank you for whenever you see this. That was beautiful. Thank you for letting us have that experience. 